Try and interpret this line. Charlie is twice as old as Dave. This means that Charlie's age is twice that of Dave's. Let's try to write this in a shorter way. Assume Charlie's age is C and that of Dave's is D. When we try to write phrases as equations, remember that the word is always means equal to. So we write an equal to after C. Twice Dave's age can be written as 2D. So C is equal to 2D is a shorter way to write this line. Here's the second line. Amar bought 5 pens more than the number of pens Ben bought. We can assume the number of pens Amar bought to be A, the number of pens Ben bought to be B. Amar bought can be written as A equals 5 pens more than some number. So we leave some space and write plus 5. 5 more than what? 5 more than the number of pens Ben bought which is B. So A equals B plus 5 explains this line in a shorter way. Easy you think? Now look at this line. Zara sold thrice as many pens as calculators. Pause the video and try to write the equation with P and C as variables. Breaking the line down, we can write thrice as many pens as 3P. As many as calculators can be written as equal to C. Thrice as many pens as calculators, right? Sorry, that's incorrect. Let's take an example. Say the number of calculators she sold is 10. So C will be 10 units. She sold thrice as many pens as the number of calculators she sold. So P will be 30. Does 3 times 30 equal 10? No. So P is equal to 3C is the correct way to write it. If C is 10, then P will be equal to 3 times 10, 30 units. 3C tells us thrice as many as calculators. Now we can move on to an actual example. The length of a rectangle is 2 more than its breadth. Find its length and breadth if its perimeter is 16 units. Let's name the length as L and the breadth as B. The length is 2 more than its breadth. This was the most important relationship in this problem. The length of the rectangle is 2 more than its breadth. We don't really need two variables here. Let's say the breadth is equal to x units. Putting x in place of b here gives us L as x plus 2. Now that we have established a relation between the length and breadth, let's move on to the second point. The perimeter is given to us as 16 units. So twice L plus b will equal 16 units. Yes. The perimeter is 2 times the length plus 2 times the breadth. As L is x plus 2 and B is x, we get this equation. Solving this, we get the value of x as 3 units. Don't forget, you are not asked to find the value of x. You are asked to find the length and the breadth. As B is x, it will measure 3 units. And as the length is 2 more than its breadth, it will measure 5 units. Always verify your answer. Length is 2 more than its breadth. That's correct. And 2 times 3 plus 5 does give us 16. So we can be certain that this is correct.